Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to this six week transformation series. I've just returned from an incredible weekend away to Kaosok National Park, which is about a three hour drive away and then a 45 minute boat ride to the lake house that we stayed at. Um, the lake house was very basic amenities, no TVs in the room, um, no uh, air conditioning, no phone reception, it was just a mattress on the floor. Uh, we did have a fan, uh, we had access to kayaks and uh, beautiful views and things like that, but it was very basic. And one thing I like to do is get away, switch off my phone, do some journaling, read, catch up on sleep, swim, sunshine, eat. Um, and just take a step back from all the stresses that life throws at you. And one way of doing that is uh, going and visiting uh, a location that is in your backyard. I lived in Darwin for many years uh, and I kick myself to this day for not getting out more and visiting some of the beautiful waterways, um, national parks and landscapes that Northern Territory had to offer. So um, I highly recommend that you guys have a look at what's going on in your life and try and plan some time away, whether you're going by yourself or whether you're going with your family or a loved one or something like that. I uh, highly recommend going out, visiting your backyard and exploring and getting away from the stresses of uh, work life in general. So uh, I'm gonna show you the videos that I took to go out to the lake, what was occurring there, and I'm also gonna talk you through the intentions that I created, what I want to get out of that trip. Let's have a look. So this is Chaolan Lake, which is in Kaosok National Park. It's about three hours drive away from where I live in Phuket. Uh, for me, I had an intention for both the Saturday and the Sunday. So the Saturday I worked in the morning and then I met my friends, picked them up, I drove up. Um, and Saturday was all about eating everything that I wanted, um, just kind of changing my mindset, getting back into nature and switching off from um, the stresses of work and life. Um, so I really focused on uh, enjoying myself, unwinding, decompressing, and I also really wanted to uh, put my mind in a good place to be able to go through um, some reflections and some projections the next day on Sunday. So I read about 100 pages of a book called Eaters, uh, Leaders Eat Last by Simon Sinek. Um, then on Sunday, uh, I went through a fast and only ate fruit and drank water. And I actually had some psilocybin in the morning, which is the psychoactive component of mushrooms. And I wanted to do that to um, put myself in an uh, elevated uh, mindset uh, and a different frame of mind uh, so that I could basically take stock of where I was at, what I was doing, and just um, kind of heighten the senses, senses and see everything that was going on.
Intention drives attention. So even on the weekends for me, even on my days off, I make sure I have an intention for what I'm trying to achieve um, and the circumstances that I'm going through, the environment that I'm putting myself in. So taking the psilocybin, for example, uh, I knew what I wanted out of that journey. So I made sure that I dosed it appropriately. I also set myself up to uh, make sure that I could get the most out of that by cleansing my mind the day before, um, going through a fast overnight, and then only uh, eating fruits, uh, drinking water, um, which kind of put me in a good place to be able to enjoy that journey for what it was, and I got everything that I wanted out of it. So uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you uh, share it with your friends and family. Hit that like and subscribe button. In the next episode, we're going to go through uh, an evening routine, which allows you to get to sleep at night, um, wake up the next day, go through your morning routine, start your day on the front foot. Much love, guys. Peace.